According to study.com, a medicinal plant can be described as any plant that has similar properties as a conventional pharmaceutical drug. For instance, noni tree, moringa tree, or guinea hen weed. For centuries, medicinal plants have been used in traditional and ethno medicine. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. For those who are new, I am a middle-aged health and fitness enthusiast from Jamaica and today I'll be sharing with you important information about medicinal plants. This will include an overview of medicinal plants, the downside of using medicinal plants, the do's and don'ts of medicinal plants, and plants that can be potentially unsafe to use. But before we get into it, please subscribe to my channel and leave a comment saying I subscribe that I will certainly reply to your comment. So let's get right into it. Historically, medicinal plants have been used by humans since ancient times. Medicinal properties that comes from plants are derived from many different parts of a plant. For instance, the roots, the leaves, the bark, the seeds, the flower, and the fruit. Each part of a plant can contain different active ingredients with a single plant. For example, the leaves of a plant can be safe to use, but the roots can be toxic. Now we're going to look at the downside of medicinal plants. Just because a medicinal plant is natural doesn't automatically mean that it's safe to use. Some medicinal plants can be toxic if there is overuse or if the dosage is exceeded. Another thing to note is that medicinal plants take longer to work compared to pharmaceutical drugs. Also, there can be drug interaction if medicinal plants are combined with pharmaceutical drugs and that can cause ill health. Do's and don'ts of taking medicinal plants. Medicinal plants should not be considered panacea or cure all for diseases. Number two, do not take them if they are growing wildly because you do not know if they have been contaminated with harmful chemicals such as insecticides. Number three, ensure that you wash them properly before consumption. Number four, never use medicinal plants if you are unsure of what they are. Number five, be aware of toxicity of certain medicinal plants. Use plants moderately. Number seven, be careful of look-alike plants as they can be poisonous. Number eight, talk to your doctor about possible interactions between prescribed medications and medicinal plants. Number nine, proceed with caution if you're allergy prone. Number 10, educate yourself about any potential concerns. Number 11, many medicinal plants are consumed in the form of herbal teas. Avoid concentrating or oversteeping a tea remedy. And lastly, because scientific studies have not been done on many medicinal plants, pregnant women, nursing women, infants, children, and the elderly should be cautious when taking medicinal plants. Now we're going to look at medicinal plants that can be potentially harmful. Number one, sarasi. Continuous use of sarasi can be toxic. Number two, comfrey. Comfrey can cause liver damage. Number three, 
garlic. Garlic can cause internal bleeding if it is taken on an empty stomach or it's taken along with prescribed medication. Number four, aki. Aki can cause poisoning if it's unripened. Number five, cassava. Cassava contains cyanide, which can cause poisoning, but if it is soaked and cooked, it can make these compounds harmless. Aloe vera. Aloe vera contains latex, which is the yellow juice that is found inside the leaves. Too much of it can cause toxicity. That's it for now, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel. I do appreciate each and every one of you. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. Also, please like and share with your friends and tell them to share with their friends because I will be uploading videos every Thursday and Sunday. Until next time, one love from the beautiful island of Jamaica. Bye, guys.